Summer is over for students in two more local school districts. Students in Norfolk and Newport News return to learn this morning. Ten on your side's Kara Dixon has more on what students in Norfolk Public Schools can look forward to. We're here in Norfolk today as students head back to class and school officials are not only working to keep kids safe from COVID, but also working to help them with any learning losses they sustained last year. As the last seconds of summer break came to a wrap, students across Norfolk made their way back to class. From high schoolers going back to those just starting kindergarten, many were excited for their first day. I'm happy. Joshua and Nicholas Drummond were back to get in school and excited to be able to be around other kids. Uh, I said virtual all the time last year. But Rachel Shames' first grader was able to spend half of last year in class. I'm feeling well. It's exciting. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad that they're back in school. Face to face. Yeah. The district is working to make sure students stay that way with masking, sanitizing, and updating their HVAC system. They've added more tutor positions and created a tutor fund to help those students who weren't learning as well at home. It was tough. It was really tough. She spent, you know, the the first part of the year virtual, and I know as I know so many kids did, and it's it's really hard, you know, especially for for kids who haven't been in a real classroom setting in a in a big elementary school. Once the day does wrap up, the district wants to remind families some students coming home on the buses might be delayed because they're facing a driver shortage. For more on Norfolk's return to learn, 